आई वॉन्ट टू टेल यू समथिंग अबाउट दियोबन दियोबिन इज़ अ गुड प्लेस फॉर लिविंग एंड इट हैज़ लेस क्रिमिनल लेस क्राइम लेस पॉपुलेशन एंड लेस पॉल्यूशन ऑल्सो एंड हैव अ वेरी गुड मोड ऑफ लाइव हेयर इट हैज़ सो मच रूल्स बट ऑल आर फ्लैक्सीबल द एटमोसफेयर ऑफ देवबंद इज वेरी नाइस इट इज नॉट लाइक दिस दैट आई एम बॉर्न इन देवबंद बट इन द होल इंडिया द पीपल केम हेयर from uh, all states other all other states and abroad uh, they say that uh, the uh, atmosphere of deoband is very good deoband they are not dangerous for india they are just religious institution they are disseminating religious education and they all are working under the guidance of indian establishment they are uh, the people who are running these organizations they are in very good contact with the indian political leaders they are in very good contact with the uh, person having uh, higher post in in the indian establishment deoband is not separate from the society as a whole deoband is a part of the entire society we want Um, to respect and uh, make powerful women and we want to respect them and uh, islam has given so many rights to women uh, but uh, we don't want to exploit them because of the free society we want to make them safe and sound and for that purpose is to uh, women are very respectable in our society and we want to give them education to give them freedom to give them each and every facility but respectfully not by exploiting them for the safeguard of women parda is a necessity and for that necessity um, women are being advised to use parda this is a tradition of deoban muslim they all are wear burqa and uh, It, they applied it very excitedly not forcefully i think uh, to cover the face is necessary so uh, it's also a part of our body uh, so it i think it's necessary it's my personal opinion i don't force my opinion to uh, anyone but it's my personal opinion islam is a very flexible religion uh, neither it snatch our liberty or not it's a burden on us according to the situation it it give many flexibility it's a very merciful and good religion i like it the most and i want to uh, follow uh, its in real senses well then i put burqa and my father will not my father was not force me to wear burqa it is my personal decision to wear burqa and uh, i follow it very excitement i wear burqa uh, with very excited uh, it's my uh, personal uh, personal desire and when i was only 13 i applied to wear burqa they can go out home from, they can go out from home and more over they can perform each and everything uh, safe um, if they are safe there if their respect is not uh, exploited by anyone if they are doing uh, respectable work um, it is very much it is welcome for their safety for their respect parda is a must i feel so much safe in burqa because nobody in recognize us and nobody see our face and not comment because uh, a girl is safe in burqa i my personal opinion is that every girl to any religion covered her face for her safety the new generation should also consider it what are the advantages of parda or veil and what are its disadvantages they are intellectuals they can see each and everything from their own eyes my aim is to become a successful doctor particularly for poor uh, and all this i want to do according to the rule of islam now doing the course of bsc bachelor of science and my subjects are
chemistry botany and zoology and then i will do msc master of science and then i will do phd this is the research work and i want to research so good that that make me famous i don't want pomp and don't power i also wants to be famous this is my personal aim uh, to show the eyes is necessary for me uh, i have to study uh, i have to dissection the body uh, and uh, it's in it's a part of my profession and i myself drive the car so it's necessary for me uh, and i said just before that according to the situation uh, the uh, religion provide flexibility my personal plan is not to be marry because it's make me bound to do any work um, i like to <laughs> marry after my success um uh, i feel comfort in burqa and i do my all uh, outside work remaining in burqa because uh, it's uh, necessary in our islam and being a muslim it's our duty to follow the rules of islam so my grandmother applied burqa is uh, so old yes my my family is uh, so religious and they used to wear burqa they all are used to wear burqa so uh, i am i am the single girl of my college uh, i only i put on burqa my none of my friend wear burqa but i feel comfort some th- time they taunt me my lecturers my professors taunt me uh, but i never mind my my class children are all hindu Uh, religion and uh, one or two girl is muslim in my class they did not wear burqa and uh, a, a girl also uh, it was my senior she put a burqa and also with gloves and she covered all the opening parts of the body i my uh, my college did not uh, allowed me uh, to cover my face uh, they said to me that uh, you sh- you have to Uh, you have to open your face otherwise we will not admitted you so i wear burqa and not op- my face covered i will highly appreciate to the girls appreciate to the girls who wearing burqa because it's very nice to cover and showing that they are the religious and wearing burqa is not that uh, you are bound you are fully bound you are not the bound you do a who having the equal status as the man having i would like to marry a woman who wear burqa and if she is not wearing burqa i'll force him and tell him please wear burqa if she doesn't want um first i have to tell it's my duty to tell to make him understand what's the value of burqa and make him to know the rules of islam about the burqa if she don't mind then in islam they said we are not compel anyone to wear we are not compel any anyone to be wear if she doesn't want so okay it's okay my mother wearing a burqa and she drives a car she is a student of uh, bms bms she is study in a college regularly she is a regular student she drives car her own and go to the college and she also wearing burqa in the college and attend the classes only in burqa we, we are linked to the religious family from the ancestor it's our duty to be continue the religious of our so that's why are the ladies of our family wearing burqa I would like to have a wife have, which is totally religious. I like who's offer five times of namaz, know about the Islamic religion. I like and she wears burqa. I like such a wife. Yeah, she must be educated and she is um, a postgraduate I minimally. If women are to be saved from exploitation, if they are to be respected in the society, then it is much it is very much necessary to keep them aloof to keep them uh, separate from women and men and uh, because men and women if they work together there are so many chances of their being exploited so for their safety it is very much necessary that parda must be observed so that they can be they can be able to do each and every work respectfully and without any fear of the society they are not being discriminated if there is no discrimination with them if they do a respectable job in society they can do it 
in this type of modern city i don't like the people who who says that the women's are slave i i'm not well, i despise such like of person i don't like it at all because women's are not slave in india and many of the countries women's now nowadays women's having a equal status as the men having and it's very bad that the, the people who says that the, the women are the slave they must need to be brainwashed i think uh, this is not inserted work to be a burqa uh, we 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 feel safe in burqa and i pass so many kilometers in burqa on footly uh, and uh, on the other hand we will not go anywhere without burqa we will not go 1 meter without burqa and then i will uh, i wear burqa so i will pass so many kilometers long length as well in hindu mainly in the hindu the religion was that not now it is in the in older times they used to kill the girl baby they considered as a curse that a curse born if a girl child born in the hindu family they says that a curse born in our family and they used to kill them and flow them to the water immediately but now it is government banned on it in muslim society no one used to kill the girls they used that this is a god gift whether it is boy or a girl they can accept it because the god gave us a girl it's very good to be a girl and or a boy it's also very good because in islam girl and a boy having equal status islam like girls because girls are the one who who made a family girls made a family and a family is needed to be a, a lady who control the family we respect women women are very valuable thing in a society if we respect them if we want to see them respectful and if we want to see them doing everything respectfully and if women also believe in this um, very theory of being respected each and every day if they want to save them if they want to get them respected by other persons they will have automatically will observe parda and will try to keep themselves aloof and to keep themselves um, separate from the man and in this way um, he will she will be able to do each and everything um, in a respectable way